What's going on, everybody? See here. Welcome back to some more Timberborn. Last episode, we got some amazing engines going, and they are amazing. However, they don't run on hopes and dreams. They run on logs, and we are officially out of logs. So this episode, we are gonna be uh, we're gonna be just kind of building some more stuff, getting some more things, uh, fortifying our beaver colonizational stuff on this entire map. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy. If you do, like, subscribe, all the fun things. Now. The plan for this episode was actually to get this whole island up and farming because if we look, uh, these houses cover this area. Uh, this house covers this area. I wanted to get these houses right here to cover these two areas. So I wanted to have, you know, a decent coverage of like all the areas. Well, because of our whole district limit thing, uh, these aren't actually connected to a district right now because it's just 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 so far away it's just so far away if it wasn't just so far away <laughs> so that's not gonna work unfortunately um and i'm trying to decide what i want to do here because at the same time like i'm not necessarily the biggest fan of this i understand it so i'm thinking maybe we're gonna have to just suck it up and get some maybe just start making some more smaller districts that are self-sustainable and then everybody can help everybody so with that being said I have no idea where we're going to go from here because <laughs> I wanted to get this island being the main island for food. Oh, <sighs> so just kind of going back and forth here. You know, honestly, I think it would be kind of fun. It would be I feel like it'd be hard to do. I'd like to have a district for like each thing, you know, like the wood chopping district, the industrial district, the food district. You know what I mean? But with logistics and beavers and running back and forth and stuff like that, like realistically, that's kind of like not going to happen. Each little district kind of needs a little bit of everything. Not necessarily everything, but a little bit of everything, you know? So, yeah, that's that's going to be the plan. I don't know what the plan is, but that there's a plan nonetheless here somewhere. But, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy. If you do, like, subscribe, all the fun things. This is Timberboard. Link down below if you want to check it out. Now, um, I kind of, like, I want to break into this side of the map over here, but there's no water storage. So... I think the best thing for us to do is to block up here and block this up and block this up and have this all be water and then maybe get a village like uh or a district over here somewhere and then that would give us the start of access to this side of the map i don't know though or we could do it on this side over here oh gosh i don't even know where to start i don't even know where i don't even know where to start all right so what i'm actually kind of thinking right now and that I'm actually really enjoying is the thought of putting a district maybe right here or right here. And the reason for that, because if we put one right here, we already have water. We already have food. We already have some logs. And this area is not getting any water at all. So we could build our floodgates in here fairly. Ooh, oh, yeah, fairly easy. We could just have a ramp going up there and ramp coming down here. Build these two floodgates and get that going let's do that let's do that let's get that going more floodgates more water control that is uh, the name of the game here i feel like it is anyway <laughs> uh let's get ourselves a district center now i'm hoping that by placing this here hmm I want to be able to reach this, this, and this. You know, I almost wonder if I can reach this side from these guys over here. I, you know what? I bet you I probably can. Let's go ahead and do that. Let's get a floodgate right in there. And then let's just get some stairs going down here. Here we go. Here we go. We'll do there, there, and we'll just remove some of these trees. Okay, we got this. We got this. Oh, look at those little beavers go. Look at them go. They're just such good little workers. Good little worker beeves. All right, there we go. Perfect. Okay, so are these within range? This construction is too far from builders. Build more paths or, oh, well, it's because it's not connected yet. Waiting on logs. Oh, that's right. Oh. Uh, you know what? It's almost daytime. Let's go ahead and let's shut these down. Because these things are going to burn our logs up. And you know what? Realistically, I don't need these going. I think these are going to be more of an emergency kind of thing. Like, if we really need a resource for some reason, 
we'll get those going, but we don't, I don't think we really need them. Unless we start getting like, you know, a stupid amount of logs. Oh, uh, you know what? We never, <laughs> our, ah, this stupid food area too. Okay, let's see here. So I could build a house right here and right here, maybe. Oh, okay. Okay, so we're gonna put up two more farmhouses there. And then, man, I was really hoping we could get those ones over there working too, but you know what? It is what it is, that's fine. We need more logs. I mean, we're gonna have a few logs coming in, but nothing crazy. I mean, I guess we got some here. Oh, drought ended. Shoot. How is this set? Um, we're gonna set at 0.5 so that way we don't flood everything. Oh yeah, look at them. They're doing the things. Okay, awesome. So really, I just need to focus on this and this. You know, I think if I put, I think if we put a city center, I think if we put one here, I think we'd be okay. Like, I really do. I think we'd be fine. So let's do that. And then let's get some uh, housing. Sleeps 10. Let's do that. And then let's just get some basic stuff in here. You know, like, let's get a little bit of water, a little bit of food. How many beavers is this? 10. We'll maybe get 10 beavers over here. Um, Let's see. Pumping station. Oh, why won't you one pumping station? Hmm. Second pumping station. Okay, so there's two pumping stations. Uh, let's see. Do we want a large water deal? I mean, you know, I feel like we do. I feel like a large water deal is always the better option here. Let's grab these and get these kind of connected up here. Now, unfortunately, I am going to have to... Oh, they're actually going to start building that. Nice. Um, oh, you know what? We could actually put a, uh, a district thing right here. Oh, you know what? That's what we'll do. We'll put a district deal right here and right here. That'll be perfect. We'll go ahead and put that there. Grab this guy. Actually, no. Let's, let's move that. Let's put it right there. And then we'll put a district gate. That guy. Oh, ho, ho. hey, yo, watch out. Um, these are all going to be at one, so we can let those do their thing. Okay, so we'll let that get built, because that should get built, actually. And then, basically, we're going to remove some things there. That's going to path there. There's going to be a home. There's going to be a water. Uh, we're going to need a gatherer flag. I think a small farm over here might be ideal. Oh, you know what? We're also going to need stairs going down into here. Because realistically, you know what? Let's go ahead. Let's get the, um, let's get our, our floodgates set out too. I mean, we know what we're doing realistically here. Realistically, we're trying to get these floodgates going. <laughs> oh, yes. Indeed, we are. So, we're going to go ahead and connect up there. To there. You know, it would not surprise me at all if this doesn't reach. It would not surprise me one little teeny tiny bit at all. How did that already get built? Oh my gosh. Out of the things, I can't believe that got built first. That's crazy. Okay, and then we're gonna need small warehouse, large warehouse. Let's do a small warehouse. Let's do that. And then, oh, you know what? We also need stairs. 
going up here. And then we need to mark these trees for cutting. And then let's get a lumberjack flag in here. Lumberjack, and then let's see, a food gathering as well. Basically grab all that. Okay, I think we're pretty much set up. Let's go ahead and let these beavers, oh yeah, let those beavers do their thing. So we need, let's see here. One, two, three, four. Four beavers to run that stuff. We're going to need a drop-off point, labor. Let's see, labor, distribution, drop-off point. We're going to need this. I don't imagine we're going to need one here, but I'm going to throw one here anyways. And we're going to throw a distribution post here. So that they can drop off stuff here. Um, one, two, th one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So eight beavers would probably be about perfect here, I think. Wait, they're coming over here to do the work. Holy moly. They're getting everything built up. Wait, can we just like, what the heck? I don't even understand what's going on here. Super amazing building beavers. We love them. Oh, you know what? I probably need a log storage, don't I? Probably it would be ideal. Get it? Wood. Ha! Uh, let's see. Well, I mean, we got general storage. We got a small warehouse. We'll be fine. Okay. Are we ready to bring the beavers over? I think we are. I think we are. Let's go ahead and do it. Let's, uh, what district is this? Um, district seven migrate to district seven. Let's go ahead and pull eight migrate. Fantastic. All right. They're coming over. Dum, 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 dum. Beavers, you have your own district. Enjoy. Enjoy. Well, once I get there, that is. Where's our new residence? Yay. We got new residence beavers. Look at that, they're already going to work. Those happy little beavers. Looks like in this area over here is gonna have a whole bunch of nice trees on it too. All right, that looks good. Let's get these connected up. Whoop. Oh my gosh. Look at that. We've got a gatherer. Uh, can you get this built? Oh, no they don't. Uh, is this built yet? Nope, <laughs> not even close. I can't get logs. I, I'm sorry. You're going to just be out of a job for a little bit here. Are you? Oh, we got to we got to hook this up to the there. There. Now they can start filling that up. Fantastic. Awesome. I think we're off to a nice little start here. Got some food. We got a little bit of water. We can always bring over food and water, too. So once we get our distribution, oh, it's already built. Jeez Louise. Add a new route. Let's go to here and let's bring them. Plank. Let's give them what do what do we what do we have a lot of? Um mm, not a lot of food. They might be okay on we might be okay on their own food. And water they're gonna be good on. So let's give them uh we got planks, maybe logs. Yeah, let's just do that. Okay, and we have our own little log gathering now because the stairs got done. So then we should be working on these. Oh, this actually needs to be destroyed. Grab that, destroy that. We'll get this going path. Pathway, please. Perfect, okay. So now I guess we kind of just wait and see because these are what, logs and planks. Um, we don't have any beavers actually currently working in there right now, so maybe we'll be able to get our own logs. Actually, I wonder if we should get a forestry going in here. Hmm. How do I only have six beavers over here? Didn't I just send over eight? Did two of them seriously get here and immediately die? 
I feel I feel like they did. I feel like they took the oldest ones and just came over here and died. Oh, okay. I need two more beavers. Um, oh, you know what? Actually, since we're popping up in other districts, let's go ahead and let's resume the baby chambers. All right. I need um, four more beavers to district seven, please. That should give us 10. Perfect. So we have two unemployed beavers here. Let's do this. Do we want to set up a forestry here? We could set up a forestry here. Or we could set up a farm. I don't know that they're going to get enough food off of just these berries alone. That's what I'm not 100% sure on, unless we increase the berry population by putting a forester down. Could put a forester down and plant trees and berry bushes. Maybe a little two-for-one action. Yeah, let's, let's try it. Uh, a forester. Let's put the forester up, like, right here. Yeah, we'll put the forester up right there. That's fine. And then uh, we'll get trees replanted, and we'll fill in the area with berry bushes, too. Maybe, maybe... Their food situation will be okay. Because honestly, once these get popped in here and this is all full of water, this whole island's gonna be nice and green too. Ooh, I'm excited about this. Okay, let's go ahead and plant trees. Let's do nine days for one, 12 for two. Let's do pine. And then let's go ahead and fill in berries here. Perfect. Okay. All right. Looks like we got uh, these guys are doing their thing. Let's go ahead and set this to one. So I'm thinking what's going to happen is that uh, these are just going to be blocked off. And these we're just going to drop. Let it fill in this area. And then. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I think it's pretty much going to be it. Maybe one of these will set to like half. So that way there's some water flow coming through here. But I, I don't think we're going to need it. And look at our water's already full here. That's insane. Oh, you know what I just realized? Logs can't actually go into there as a storage. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Uh, <laughs> I didn't even realize that. Uh, Let's get a platform in here. And then... I need a log storage. Yeah, we'll do that and then we'll cancel these. I can't, <laughs> I can't believe that. I was like, oh yeah, this will work. Nope. Logs need to go in the log pile. How's this town looking? Mmm. Our food is not doing hot. Oh, you know why? We got these right here. We don't have no crops in here. Well, let's get some crops planted. Jeez Louise, I think we should get wheat going because then we could get bread. Yeah, let's do that. There they go. Look at them. Okay. That'll help. Yeah, that'll help because then they're also helping down here too. These guys, of course, there's nobody can reach them. Yeah, I'm actually kind of really worried about this uh, this food situation for this main colony now because it's like, it's not great. <laughs> we are living off of berries, and that's we should not be living off berries yet. Or we should not be living off of berries anymore. Not yet. It should not be an any more thing. Ugh. You know, um, this district's not doing too hot. 13 water. They don't have a water pump. How many people are how many people are still living here? Oh, there's only two. Oh shoot. Uh we have residential for eight. Let's get six beavers sent over there to replace that. Oh jeez. Migrate. Six adults. Uh going to. Oh, not sixty. Six. To district two. Migrate. Alright. Let's get these uh Machines populated back up here. There you go. Water pumpage. We got some scrap. 
What are we what are we loaded up on? Scrap metal. Holy moly. Oh, it's because we didn't have any uh yeah, we didn't have any distributors. Distributors. Dis <laughs> distributor. Dis I don't even know how I said that the first time. Oh shoot, they're out of food. Okay. Add new routes. Let's go ahead and let's give them some. Oh, I don't want to give them berries. Let's give them berries. So they don't die. Okay, so apparently that many berries is not enough. Uh, you know what? We're going to cancel those and just bring over berries. <laughs> Come on. I don't want people dying of, of starvation. We are way too weird. Our civilization's way too old for that. Oh, look at all the bread they just got. 280 bread. Oh. Wait, where is that bread? 78. 200. Nothing. Wait, where's... 100 bread. Why is there 100 bread in there? Who is anybody distributing over here? What town is this? District, District 6? We should have nothing going to District 6. I guess they just have 100 bread on them. Jeez. Okay, so now we have now we have food. Now we have food in here. Now we're good to go. Wait. How do we only have five beavers in here again? Died of old age. Died of old age. Grown up, grown up, grown up. <laughs> they keep dying. They're getting too old. I need five more beavers over here now. Jeez Louise. Oop, drought started. It is time. We gotta lock up some stuff. Here comes the deadness. And we should be good. We should be able to go ahead and lock her down. Perfect. Okay. Okay, so these are all done. Now the question is, will they reach these over here? It looks like it. Looks like they're building that one. I mean, maybe it's going to be close. Oh, it's going to be so close. It might. I think they, I think they will build them. I think they will. Oh my gosh, that's going to be huge. This literally this half of the map is this whole section right here is going to be full of water all the time. Oh, it's going to be good. It's going to be good. And then we can start, uh, like I said, we can start populating over here and kind of start branching out into uh into these little islands over here and then maybe start blocking this off and then like the whole map control the entire map of water that's what i want to do all of the water is ours it's a short dry season well maybe maybe it wasn't well that one's already built how's uh, everything looking here food water food is okay how's food and water here starting to get so oh those are potatoes jeez i mean we got wheat we're going to get wheat for a little while because, I mean, I guess I could turn. I guess we could go ahead and turn on some of these engines. We'll turn on two of them for now. Oh, I can't wait till these all get built. And then we can, like, release the water into all of these areas. Oh, it's going to be so good. I'm so excited about that. Oh, yeah, they're all getting built. Look at that. Not and, and not even a single one says without a range <laughs> it's, or that it's without range. Oh, it's so good. It's so good. Now I'm going to leave these here. I could destroy them, but we, we went through all the time to put them there. So I'm just going to I'm just going to drop them down, lower them. Um, I think I want to lower them down to point five. And then let everything like, kind of like fill in, you know. All right. Today's the day. Today is the day. The final one has been built and guess what that means we now have control over this half of the map so the drought just ended we're gonna go ahead we're gonna set this back down to five but we're gonna let's let's let the water get back in here let's let the water get back in here first hold on a second actually you know what let's set that back up to one let's let it hold it in for a second Oh, I'm so excited about this. Oh, we're going to have half of the map of water is ours. 
it's just it's a it's just an amazing thing come on there it is come on water faster oh i can actually adjust it while i'm still like looking over here nice and the water is here now it's gonna hit over here okay so these are all blocked up now what i could do and i was actually thinking about it is actually getting dynamite and blowing a section of this out deeper but i don't think we need to i think we're gonna go ahead i think we're gonna do this stuff oh i'm so excited okay hold on let's let everything get caught up here i mean i'm gonna pump this up to one we're gonna block this completely because I'm, I'm like i'm waiting for this water to fill up here okay put that back at half let's put this at half put this at half and put this at half water is officially in we have it it's here okay so now i did notice this in the beginning of the game is that once all these were open this would never really got filled up but i don't think that's gonna be the case i think we, i think we have enough control over the water that this will indeed all fill up oh look at that look at the water there's so much wonderful water in here oh it's a little flooding uh is it gonna flood i don't think so i think we're good i think we're good holy moly oh my gosh we have all of the waters all right can we just slow down time and appreciate all of the water this whole area will never dry out it's so oh, okay i'm not gonna say never like if there was like a 30 day like drought like okay probably yeah it, it would probably dry out but still like that's super awesome I'm so like absolutely thrilled about that. Uh, we need to get these re like replanted. I'm thinking we should throw water pumps over here too, because like, pff, why not? Uh, that's a huge pool of water. But we did it. We got this whole area done. Oh, it's so nice. It is so nice. Now this area right here, honestly, this whole half of the map, I think we need. I think we could make it too water, like too deep. I think we could get the um a double floodgate put in in on all of these and we can make this whole side too deep so that would be fun i think that'd be a lot of fun i i, I want to check that out but that's gonna end this episode thank you so much for coming out hopefully you guys enjoyed if you did like subscribe all the fun things this is again timberboard link down below but what do you think how, how do you think the uh i think we're good i think we're in like we're in a good spot here. Uh, food. Food is still not a great thing. <laughs> food is still not a great thing. So I'd like to get that going. Um, actually, don't even need this going. We don't need either of these going, honestly. Yeah, I'd like to get food going. Um, maybe it might be who of us to go ahead and start up a little, another little farming district. And kind of get some food stuff going. So, I don't know. We'll see. But, yeah. Thank you again for coming out. Hopefully you enjoyed. That's going to end it. Have a fantastic rest of your day. And I'll see you next time.